Hello and uh, welcome to chapel. Good to uh, see you all back here again. First of all, the Black Student Association will be having a movie night this Saturday at 8 p.m. And it will cost $1 to come and they're showing the movie Skin. Tonight from 8 to 11 at Owens Supermarket, there's going to be the Supermarket Sweep. And what's going to happen is you and your growth group will go and they will be uh, cleaning Owens. No, I'm just kidding. You will go and uh, buy a bunch of groceries with your growth group and then you will just donate them at the cash register. You'll just give them to some people and they will give them to the community. Really cool. I mean, you know, last year, Beta 2 North, uh, my hall, raised the most money last year, so... Cheaters. <coughs> storing up treasures in heaven. Ah, uh, prideful. <coughs> Hey, Brock, yeah. uh, do you know whether it's more politically correct to say African-American or black? Yes, it is. I would concur. Okay. Uh, have you ever wanted to touch a black person's hair? Matt, I never want to touch anybody's hair. If you have any questions regarding such things, uh, there will be a question and answer session on November 20th at 6 p.m. Um, with the Black Student Association. And where is that going to be at, Matt? In McLean Auditorium. Cool. Hey, Matt, are you crafty? But yes, I am. Wait, wait, what do you mean by crafty? I was thinking, like, painting or pottery or, or baking. Oh, no, I, I'm not crafty at all in any of those ways. Okay. Well, if you were, then you could make some of that stuff and then sell it at a craft show that's going to be held around Christmas time. If you would like more information, you could contact John Sloat. Okay. He also broke my collarbone. A couple Whatever years Sloat's ago. your boat. <laughs> that's actually that was a good one. Really funny. Wait, well, actually, I do kind of do some of that stuff. Like, yeah. I kind of combined pottery and bread baking. I, I just kind of, you know, mix the dough and then put clay in it and then put it in the kiln and fire it. I kind of do the same thing with painting and donuts. And instead of just using glaze, I actually paint them. But people got real sick, so I don't do it anymore. Well, you probably shouldn't be using that lead paint, Rock. No. It just works so good, though.